The Honor X8 and X9 5G are Honor's latest mid-range phones to hit the market with a really decent spec sheet. The Honor X9 5G is powered by a Snapdragon 695 processor with 8GB of RAM and 128GB of storage, while it has a 6.81-inch 120Hz Honor full-view display and a 4800mAh battery with 66W Honor Supercharge. The Honor X8 is a sleek device that measures 7.45mm slim and weighs 177 grams. Powered by a Snapdragon 680 processor, it comes with an immersive 6.74-inch Honor full-view display and a 64-megapixel quad-camera system. Best of all, these phones come pre-installed with official Google mobile services. Of course, today's video is not about reviewing these phones, but we are going to put them in a series of stress tests because Honor claims that these phones are made tough by calling them Lucky Tahan, Lucky Best. So if you are someone who's afraid of breaking your next smartphone, watch on and find out if these phones can survive our wrath. One, two, three. Go! Okay, and that is stress test number one, which is our drop test. So you see how we trash the phones around the office and you can see that the screens are still intact. That last drop was actually pretty rough though. The X9 5G managed to survive with no cracked screen. The X8 as well, apart from the fact that the screen protect protector has already came out right over here. So the only damage that these two phones actually got is scarves and dents around its frame, which is kind of expected based on the way on how we drop them, which is quite okay as long as you don't have a cracked screen or a cracked bed and that's actually pretty okay already. The second stress test that we are going to do now is the bend test. Now, instead of using my hands to bend the phones, I'm going to do it a little special. So we've got a clamp right over here that is clamped on the Honor X9 5G right now. We're going to do that to the X8 as well, but first it will be the X9 5G. So I've got a 12 kilogram kettlebell right over here, which I'm going to place it on top of the Honor X9 5G and see whether it bends or not for the next five minutes. So I've got my timer right here. I'm going to launch the timer right now. There we go. And we're going to put the kettlebell on top here and see whether if it bends. Right? Here we go. Alright, 8 more seconds and we are going to unclamp the Honor X9 5G. 3, 2, 1. There you go. Time's up. And let's just take this kettlebell off the Honor X9. Good job. And let's see whether if the phone is bent or not. All right. And clamp this phone. All right. So there you go. The Honor X9 5G remains in form. It is not bent at all. As you can see, this is a 12 kilogram kettlebell that's pressing right on top of the phone and it's very very impressive that it didn't get bent at all. And next, we're going to try it out on the Honor X8. more seconds to go we are almost done with the band test on the honor exit and in five four three two one let's take away this kettlebell and <laughs> let's stop the timer first and we're gonna unclamp the honor exit Let's see whether it bends or not. Now, um, while the kettlebell was on top of the order exit, I do realize that the phone actually bent a little, but once I unclamp the phone, as you can see, it still remains in form. So it doesn't get bent all the way down when you have the kettlebell on top. So the reason why we are doing this test is because just in case if you're someone that puts your phone into your back pocket and you sit on it, most phones will probably get bent if you are a pretty heavy person or if you happen to put it somewhere else and you just simply just apply some pressure on the phone, 
they might get banned easily. But fortunately, both the Honor X8 and the X9 5G survived the ban test. And the third stress test that we are gonna do to the Honor X9 5G and X8 is the freezer test. Yes, we are gonna freeze these phones to see whether they will still turn on. So what I'm gonna do right now is to have these two phones in this waterproof bag because they are not IP, water, and dust resistant. So we're gonna put into this purple container here, which I really filled up, filled up with water. So let's just put the phones in right now. All right. And we're gonna close this container right now and put this box inside our freezer. So it's almost 6 p.m. already and I am about to go home so we have gotta wait until the next day to find out if these two phones will still turn on because I already have their display set to always on and we shall find out the next day. Tomorrow. All right, it's a new day and it's time to find out the moment of truth on what happened to these two Honor X phones. All right, as you can see right now, the phone is entirely frozen in this uh, ice box here. So we're gonna pour out this ice here, hopefully it works. <laughs> oh my god, there you go. Okay, there you go. We are almost there. Oh, look at this. It survived. Look, um, this is the Honor X9 5G, but the screen of the Honor X8 is off, but I'm sure it should be backed up if I press on the power button. Probably ran out of battery, but we are gonna find out uh, what happens when we charge it up, all right? So let's just get this, um, let's just get this phone out of here. Yep, so it's confirmed that, you know, the Honor X9 actually survive this free test all right so we finally managed to get the ice off this velcro here i'm going to take out the honor x8 and the x9 all right we're taking out both of these phones right now Whew. uh water actually got in a bit but here we go the honor x9 5g survived with about 38 percent of battery so i'm very sure that the battery on the X8 died, but we're gonna charge it up and find out if it turns all right. So let's dry the phone for a bit. Okay, moment of truth. As you can see, the Honor X8 is still very cold. You can plug the USB cable, and hopefully it comes back on. Woo, that's a vibration, all right. <laughs> okay, so yeah, apparently the phone ran out of battery during the freezer test, but we can assure you that both the Honor X8 and the X9 5G survived in our freezer tests. And the final stress test that we are gonna do to these two Honor phones right now is the heat test. Now, usually when you record video under the hot sun here, most phones would usually turn off. So we're gonna find out if the Honor X8 and X9 5G turns off under the hot sun. It's actually pretty hot right now, even though I'm like on the rooftop right here. So we're gonna hit the record button right now for about 10 minutes and we shall find out if they successfully recorded a 10 minute video, all right? So let's just tap on the record button and we'll find out 10 minutes later. Five minutes later. Five minutes into the video recording already, and let's find out what is the temperature of the phones right now. So, let's look at the Honor X9 5G. It's 35.8 degrees Celsius. And the Honor X8, 38 degrees Celsius. Yep, so they definitely heat up a little when we shoot video, but let's find out what happens after another five minutes, right? A few minutes later. And now we have reached 10 minutes. We are gonna find out what are the temperatures on these two phones. As you can see, the sun is pretty strong right now. So let's see. Right, so the Honor X9 5G has a temperature of 37.7 degrees Celsius 
and the RX8, 38 38.5 degrees Celsius. And these two phones are still recording as of right now. They did not show any overheating message, so they could definitely last under the sun when you're shooting videos. And that's a good thing. So there you have it. After going through so many tests, the Honor X8 and X9 5G survived all of our tests so well that I believe that it will definitely survive your rock if you're a clumsy person on smartphones. So the Honor X series consists of the X9 5G, X9 4G, X8 and the X7 and they will start from 699 ringgit and they are all this reliable. And Honor is so confident about these phones that they are offering a one-year free extended warranty when you purchase any of these X-series phones before the end of June. Right, so that's pretty much for the stress test video for today. Thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned for more videos coming right up on the channel. Stay subscribed and I will see you guys in our next one.